This entire film seems to have been planned as an elaborate scheme to slowly push the cast into going insane. The directors of the Blair Witch Project gave the three cast members cameras, supplies for survival, and a place to meet up. From there, the three were essentially left alone in the woods. A few scenes from the movie are from when they were actually lost trying to figure out the next meetup point. Oftentimes, the directors would secretly follow the cast and break sticks or throw rocks around the unknowing campers. And every once in a while, if it was dark, you'd see this red beam and you knew it was <laughs> it was the Haxon band of goons running around again. Worse yet, the directors gave them less food every day to make them ragged, angry, and more on edge. And as the days went on, the filmmakers came up with new ways to torture their actors. And they were setting up, you know, sound loops of babies crying and kids laughing outside our tent at four in the morning. Basically, it was just us running through trees and going nuts out there. After eight days of filming, it's safe to say that the cast no longer enjoys walks in the woods. 